Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will see how we can easily download and install the current NetBeans on Windows. So the current NetBeans version is NetBeans 15. So to install NetBeans, we also need Java. So at first we will install the current Java version. Then we will install NetBeans. So let's start with the download and installation of the current Java version. First go to the web browser. I am using Chrome, you can use any browser. On Google search, type Oracle Java. Press enter. On pressing enter, the official website is visible oracle.com. Click on it. So here is the page oracle.com slash java. On the right itself, you can see download java is visible. Click on it. So I have clicked here. On going below, you can see java 19 is available now. So this is what we wanted. Go below again. Here and you can see java 19 download is visible. JDK kit. Click on Windows because you want for Windows. Here in three versions are visible. You need to click on the x64 installer. Here it is exe file. Click on it. This also includes JRE, so you don't need to install JRE separately. Click on it. Now the download started. Let's wait for a few seconds. So the download completed. Double click on it to install. Minimize this. So guys, the installation setup is visible. Click on next. Herein, our Java will get installed under the following directory. If you want to change the location, you can click on change, but keep the default. We will see this later. Click on next. So guys, we successfully installed Java 19. Click on close. Now let us see wherein we install Java. Go to C drive, double click, go to program files. Now here in Java is visible, double click. Here it is JDK 19, click on it. Go to bin, right click and copy this path. Now minimize. Go to start, type environment variables. Click on the following, edit the system environment variables, click on open. Under advanced, click on environment variables. Now here it is, go to system variables. Go to path, double click on it. Now click on new. And just paste the same path, that is the following. Click on new, right click and paste. Okay. After that, click on new gear again. Click on new here and let us set another path. Go to C drive, program files, common files, Oracle, Java, and Java path. Copy this, right click and copy. Go to the following new and just right click and paste the same path okay we have set two paths now click on ok now herein we need to set another path the last path java underscore home for that click on new enter the variable value java underscore home okay and under the variable value go to the path again that is c drive program files java and just copy this path not the bin paths only this path that's it now right click and paste it so we have set three paths here click on ok ok and the last ok now when you will go here edit the system environment variables and click on open environment variables again you can see we have our java underscore home path which we just set with that uh, double click here and we have our two paths which we set just now jdk19 bin and uh, Oracle. Okay, so we have successfully installed and set up Java. So guys, we successfully installed Java. Let us verify. Go to start. Type cmd. Click on open. To open the command prompt, type java space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. Here it is. We successfully installed Java 19. Let us close this. Now we will 
download and install Apache NetBeans current version that is NetBeans 15. Let's start. At first we will download. Go to the web browser. I am using Chrome. You can use any web browser. On Google type NetBeans. Press enter. On pressing enter the official website is visible. Click on it. NetBeans.apache.org On reaching the official website it will directly show you a button to download NetBeans 15. Click on it. Now you can see NetBeans 15 is visible and uh, below that it will be visible that uh, NetBeans 15 requires JDK 11 plus that is Java 11 plus. So we already installed it I have shown. Okay so now directly click on any of the installer here it is Windows x64 we want for Windows. So I'll click here to download. Click here to download. Download started 435 MB let's wait for few minutes. So guys we have successfully downloaded the exe file double click on it to install minimize the installer started here and you can see it will install the following if you want to go for customized installation it's your wish you can click on customize here okay but I'll keep it as it is. This will allow me to even work on Java, HTML5, JavaScript and web development like PHP under Apache NetBeans. So click on next. So click on next. Accept the license agreement. Click on next again. You can see it will install the Apache NetBeans ID under the following location. And it also took a JDK version, Java version. So we installed uh, Java 19, JDK 19 before. It automatically took it. So we don't need to change anything. Click on next. Okay, keep it as it is and this is the folder we saw before. Click on install. And the installation will now begin. Installation completed. Click on finish. Now we have successfully installed Apache NetBeans. Shortcut got created. You can also go to start and type NetBeans and it will be visible. Here it is. You can click on open here. Okay, I'll click on the shortcut. So here it started. If you want to show this again, you can keep it as it is or uh, you can unselect it. Okay. Now I'll go to file and click on new project. I'll create a new project basic. Click on Java with Maven and Java application. Click on next. We are creating a simple application. Here it is. Let us name the project. So the name let's say is Amit Java application you can add any name. Project location is the following you can change it if you want. And here is the package. I will change the package. Let's say my company to Studiopedia. And click on finish. Now it will create a first Java project on NetBeans. Here it is. Okay under source packages. You can uh, change it to Let's say here it is. Go to file, save all. Now to run it, directly click here, run button. It will run the project Ami Java application, and the output should be visible. Now, guys, here you can see build success, and the output is visible. Okay, following is the output my first Java programmer NetBeans 15. This is what we printed. So guys in this video we saw how we can easily download the current NetBeans version with Java and run our first program on NetBeans. Thank you for watching the video.